Spritz 380 uh, on the approach to the glide slope. Let's just cut in for this 777. Welcome, guys. Watching Big Jet TV live. London Heathrow from the Fissile. Uh, Heavy on the brakes there. MEA's 330 being uh, taxied. Looks like it uh, is probably on his way out to departures. Oh, that's nice, that 777 there. Yeah, welcome everybody. Oh, okay, here we go, here we go. I've got something uh, pretty decent. I think that's a Dreamliner second out, JB. Is it? Well, he was, he was a long way over. No way in the world we're going to pick that up. Real problems, mate, with the... Uh, Big heat haze, obviously causing uh, atmospherics, causing problems with our focus, guys. Tell us how the audio is going. Slightly different uh, micro uh, mic microphone positioning today. New transports have just arrived, so we're going to have a issue with our uh, with our shots here. German wings, by the looks of it, JV. Just wait for all the cut the trees down comments. Speed brakes active. Cafe Pacific Triple Seven sitting over there waiting for departure. Here we go. I could sing that fantastic song, I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. Anybody uh, out there got any good friends who live in London who are lumberjacks? Interesting how this Dreamline is pulling in where it is, JB. Right in front of us. It must be going out. Why would he do that? Imagine if he ran out zero nine left. Wow! What? What? How cool would that be? Windsock has completely changed, mate. Look at the windsock. No, they're still departing, yeah, definitely. 
Yeah, there's no change in the stack. We've still got three, four, five, including three eighties coming in zero nine. Who have we got in the house? Anybody? Three eighties just come in. Yeah, people still building. Everyone's saying hello. Yeah, unfortunately, we've got ourselves a little transport here, guys. Um, but you know, what can you do? They've got to do their job. Yeah. While we're trying to do our job. Nice. Just missing that money yeah. shot, mate. We just get the reverse thrust action like that, like that. So, it's coming in next. That, that uh, Emirates is lined up 09. I think that flipping Dreamline has lost, mate. Or he's, he's been given sure another he's been, slot. He's been pushed back this way and told to go around that way. Maybe. Uh, so there's a quite a lot of traffic lining up there in front. Sticks are very stiff, mate. Just uh, wind this up a little bit down there, get that uh, changed out down there. Move the microphone across. Hello, so I've got, we've got uh, A3 is going over the runway. Is it? Okay, I've got him. I've got him. I wonder if I can pick him up. Let's just have a little look, see. That's Emirates 380 going in 2709 right. That would be a full on road, JB, wouldn't it? Yeah. So Tish Rosales, we're on runway 09 left at the moment. Next in, SAS A320 from Copenhagen. You get a nice cross shot there. He's long. Touchdown, that little gap. No, he's not. He's long. Oh, he's too wow, he's very long. Touchdown now. Wow. That's real long. Real long. Yeah, 380 now coming to the right. Nice he's not shot. back again, is he? <laughs> Just like going to make his mind up. 380 arriving to the right. That's BAs, yeah. Oh, okay, sorry, yeah. missed it, yeah. We might have the BA in zero nine left. Yeah, people saying truck and trees are annoying, but it's still damn good. Ross Bailey, it's because uh, there's so much traffic. So much traffic here at Heathrow where they do do dual runway landings. Also, because the 380s create so much weight to have, but then she has to have at least a three or four mile of weight behind it. So, in order to get the tithers in, like they are now on 09 left. Giddy Presswood, 747 from Phoenix. <laughs> Stack forming JB. Are it's they all tiddlers though? Water. Is it a tiddler stack? Singapore Screamer. Yeah, Andrew. And Singapore really. Slinger, should I say? Yeah. I'm not with it today, unfortunately, guys. I see him taxiing out for uh, departure. Yeah, sorry about the uh, truck in the way, guys. And obviously, very sorry about the tree in the way as well. Trees. Hello, Amanda. Ten PM in Australia, real David Williams. Wow. Yeah, it is a beautiful day.
4.19 in the morning in Alaska for Brian Segerman. Wow. Wow. 4.19 a.m. It's pitch dark, man, and well, he's that's watching. The 380's coming 09 left, so finally. Yeah, we have a, uh, we have a heavy. Right down the pipe. Another heavy offer as well. This one, BA from San Francisco. It's a landing aircraft, which we're getting confirmation for now from Rome, Airbus A320. Just missing that touchdown, man. Oh dear. Creating the stack. Looks like Aer Lingus, mate. Wow, Megs Thompson watching the rivals via Big Jet TV and watching departures via her window. <laughs> Gotta be the 747 Patix. Scott Hardy, 747 in soon. How's the audio, mate? Can we. Uh... Yeah, audio's good. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Here we go. Here's the biggie, followed by a biggie. British pilot on the Emirates. Yeah, the friend saying we could stand on the truck, could we not? Well, that would be interesting, wouldn't it? Here we go, from San Francisco, BA A380. Slam it down first. going pretty quick this guy, I have to say, this guy with the transporter. Oh yeah. He's moving pretty quick. I did see another one coming down the road though. <laughs> did you? Oh, I see there's something so going out. So what you're seeing over there, guys, is uh, should see the slinger at some point, or is he just parked up? I see his tail over there. But he's in the uh, he's in the hold pattern. Oh, just for a moment, you get that slight, tiny little moment, JB, yeah. where you think, oh, TriStar. Yeah. See? Yeah. TriStar. Yeah, I know what you mean. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Wow. So, Shannon Jones saying MS-777 from Cairo in next. Hey, 
There goes that Iceland there. Brian Segerman, uh, we ain't pitch black. We're 24 hour daylight the whole summer. Oh, wow. Wow, in Alaska, of course. Wow, that's crazy. Wow. So here comes Triple Seven in next. First one I didn't get deep. It's typical. So what's in next? Another triple seven. That banking American. Uh, like another nice, yeah. There. All BA380 fleet have been given nicknames by Captain Dave Woolsworth, the 380 pilot. Has he now? It's Marek Jones from uh, Anglesey, that information there. That would be good to know, wouldn't it, Johnny? So we could uh, say, here comes whoever it is. Yeah. So in next... Yeah, you're going to see, there's the slinger there. Egypt Air see that man I cannot see that I cannot see that won't pick it up okay transport has got one more to go and then at least we have a uh, oh there we go triple is that a uh, yeah triple seven pushing back no, 7-6 is it? Brand new Kuwait Airways 777 on its way in, only a week old on its second visit to LHR. Is that the one we just shot? That's Dave, no, Kuwait Airways. Yeah, we just shot Kuwait. I thought that was Egypt Air. Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Miles away. I mean, they do have very similar liveries actually nowadays, they've got the same colours. But yeah, apparently... Uh, Brand new Kuwait. Yeah, only a week old, second visit to LHR. Yeah, Andrew Sassoli Walker saying beautifully smooth triple seven landing. It indeed was. So uh, Andrew's going to send us the uh, 380 list of all the nicknames. Yes, please do. That'd be great. So then we can check it on flight radar against its ident, mm. and then um, know indeed. which one it is. Indeed. Okay, little uh, flurry of tiddlers. Yeah, two BA seven four seven coming in. Is it? Now that 747 that's uh, coming in over there, that, that's higher than that 380 on 09, so it's a possibility it should come in 09F. Possibility. So that 380 is coming back up the taxiway now. Kershaw on the house.
That's uh, BA 380 from San Fran that's just landed. So everybody on Facebook, just uh, remember we're reading out YouTube comments. Three Why don't you head to Facebook and read them out, mate? Because we're now uh, we're now talking about um, how many have we got in in, in, uh, in Facebook at the moment. Well, I think we'll probably have more on Facebook. Yeah, I think we should speak to everybody on Facebook, man. Because now what we're here's one of Qatar 319s, mate. Oh, here we go. So it looks like Fairford might be an option for next week, mate. Okay, so I'm going to swap back to Facebook now for a few Facebook comments. Facebook, how are you doing? Facebook, you see, I'm overheated both of them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they said can't use it until it cools down. What the guy pack? Yeah, both of them. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's because they're in direct sunlight. But that's I've had that before with my own iPads. Bloody hell, yeah. oh, okay. Everybody who's watching on YouTube, we're now going to stop reading YouTube comments and come and read out some Facebook comments. So, hello everybody. Who we got in the house? We've got John Rivera. We've got Jaff Nagafor. See if Damien Kershaw switches over. Yeah, I'm sure he will. So, switch over, guys. Oh. Craig Rhodes, I see there's a lot more viewers this week. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Here comes another uh, nice, tasty transporter. transporter truck. So people who are into their... Oh, go on, keep going, keep going, mate. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, he's... No. He's in the touchdown zone, mate. He's in, right in the touchdown zone, mate. Mind you, to be honest with you, I'd rather him be there than... Because he's... Oh. <laughs> oh, another one, mate. Another one. Look at that. Back-to-back -back yeah, Qatar. Did it like uh, thingy. Yeah, Nazim, it is hot out here, maybe 25 to 28 degrees. AC20, that's up. He's going down. Good afternoon, Speedbird 156. Nice. Got Ron Record watching on Facebook from uh, Arizona. Good afternoon, Barry McAlpine's in the house. 747 on final, I've been told. And there we go, look. 747 indeed confirmed. Nice, nice. Like Three out. Another 747 coming in as well. Nice. So potentially two 747s in a row. See if I can grab it. Peter Jackson watching at 10.30 p.m. Uh, on Facebook in Melbourne. Wow. And Wendy van der Weg watching from the other side of the North Sea. Nick Couch in the house. Oh, look at that shot, mate. Oh, is that is that two 747s? I think so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Camera didn't hold on to it. Got Waikiki Kit watching from Kenya. Gear coming down on that first 747. John Rivera, never thought I'd love this. It's great to hear, John. So what was John Rivera, how did he find us? That's yeah. the question, isn't it? Was he just completely random? Yeah. Was he just flicking through Facebook? Did it post up? Did it notify yeah. him? How did you find us? That is two 747s. It is. Such a rare occurrence in the world of aviation nowadays, but that's what you get here at Heathrow. You certainly do, young man. God, I'm hot. <laughs> is this the CS100 coming in now? I don't know, let's have a little look. I think it is, mate. Or is that uh, 
Yeah, I think you're right. Just checking on radar. Yeah, CS100. So oh, listen to that. Three special aircraft coming in right now for you guys. Live London Heathrow, 26 degrees. Beautiful new aircraft here. I believe Swiss is the air carrier. She makes a lovely noise. Go down as well. Yeah. Anybody can tell us what what power plant they use on the uh, Embraer. Yeah, it should be interesting. Actually. Right, first 747 coming in is from Q8 City, BA. Second behind is from Phoenix, BA. So, uh, oh, I'll tell you what, Jerry, he's right here, actually. Nice, nice. He's still on the wrong way. He'll make it down easy. He'll make it down easy. Would be interesting for a go around though. Oh, wouldn't it just? Here's the uh, confirmation of that. Sorry if I hit your arm then. You called it man, you called it. You called it. He really wanted to put it down there as well, didn't he? Okay, listen out for the uh, blah blah. He just thinks it's a bit too bad. Let's put another 5,000 pounds spent on that go around. Wow, yeah. What a bang. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Beautiful, guys. Big 380 going out. There's the Singapore Slinger going out to uh, zero 09 right. Facebook's crashed because uh, that was so intense. <laughs> what? And you know what the best thing about it is? We confirmed another 747 in about 10 minutes. Yeah, now. that's the great <laughs> thing. Shall I swing it? Yeah, swing it. What a beautiful go around that was. It was. You just you could just see it happening, couldn't you? Nose up attitude. Yeah. yeah, it's the first one that counts, you see. Straight in with another 747, big jet TV. No, he's not. Just missed it. Big, massive flare there from that sunset. Wow. Yeah, that's the <laughs> How guys. cool was that, man? What a go around. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> so that's just, just coming in nice and close. See that CS still going down the wrong way. It's like, you know what, he's going to go around. And he did. Good call, man. Good call. So you should see him banking over round yeah. to our, uh, now... Karen Solly, Karen Solly, he went around because of traffic on the runway. The previous aircraft that landed just didn't get off the runway uh, fast enough. Here at London Heathrow, 99% capacity, these things happen. Yeah. So he obviously maybe missed his vacate point. Yeah. Uh, just had to run on a little bit further. The Singapore Slinger just passed uh, Meg Thompson's uh, window. Nice. Everybody watching on YouTube, just bear in mind we are now reading out comments on Facebook. So uh, Head over to Facebook, guys. If you don't know what that means, if you've just found us randomly on, on, on YouTube, go to Facebook, type in Big Jet TV, like the page, and the stream is there to watch. Yeah, make sure you like the page, guys. Really important that you do that. Interesting sort of like just a van sitting there, JV. Where's that? Over there on the apron. In front of that Air Canada. It's just a van. Oh, yeah, it's just kind of crazy it. to see a random sort of like van. white van. But yeah. uh, there you go. KLM. KLM. 7 7 now. Nice one for Trey. A little bit wobbly, isn't he? Yeah, she's a beautiful aircraft.
is always late. There you go. <laughs> it's quite funny how they are the touchdown before in the thing or right in that little slot there. Another, it looks like potentially another Qatar 320 coming in. Let's have a little look. It's, uh... Now, one thing we will get is that 747 making a beautiful noise. Hey, Tim Steele. Tim Steele in the house. Now, this looks to be a, this is now the uh, Aer Lingus 320. Stephen Heron saying General Electric CF34 engines, I presume you're talking about on the CS100. On the Embraer, yeah. yeah. General Electrics, yeah. wow, interesting. On the CS100. Thanks for that, mate. Mucho appreciato. BA 747, 50 minute out, BA 242 from Mexico landing before that missed BA 747. That's some nice info there from Steve Laws. Paul Motley Dobson watching on my 55 inch TV on surround system and reading the comments on Facebook. Nice. That is That's the way to go, isn't it? Yeah. It's funny, when we pulled up here, we saw a, uh, it was either a 319, I think it was a 319 Lufthansa go yeah. around, didn't we, JB? Yeah. It's just a high yes, volume yes. of. Uh, Especially this time of day. A high lot of movement here at London Heathrow. Oh, look at that, Jerry. Hi, hi, there's the Q8. Wow, yeah. Brand new two week old Q8 that people are talking about. You're going to have to pick him up, mate, because. Got him? No, I haven't. No. I can't see him. Yeah, it's so that's the two week old Q8 that. Uh, I can't remember his name, Jerry. Who called that one, guys? That was on YouTube, that call. And just as we let this timber go through, people may appreciate that high fire right above us. Oh, yeah. We'll wait for her to come to shop. Is it maximum brightness on this bloody thing? Uh, yeah. But yeah, 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 I know. The sun, the, they do put pretty, pretty badly in the sun. So that's, that's like a, that's a high-flying 777 there. So guys, just bringing up the page at the moment. I'm uh, going to jump on the car and see you guys. 777. Whilst we're actually live, let's see if we can get any um, new guys to come on and like the page. That would be pretty good. Cool. Couldn't in the end, unfortunately. Rob Sky. Rob Sky asking, we just show planes landing the whole day. We'll we'll show whatever movements we can, Rob. Douglas John in Norfolk. SP Shuvo, how are you doing? Thanks for tuning in. To that. No, no, it's just in the wrong place, that's all. Right, there we go. Cool. Thanks, so, Ian Wiseman, SP, um, SP Shuvo, obviously. Agilan. Uh, guys, when you're um, when you're on the Facebook page, just do us a favour and go in and like it, if you would. I think we're on 9419 or something, JB. Let's just see if we can get one more. Yeah, let's get to 10,000. Tyler McFadden, how are you doing? Wow, it's hot. <laughs> Dude, what? have you seen how many people are watching? Yeah. 1,200 people, man. Yeah. Wow. That's great. Faisal Magta, how are you doing? Just joined the, uh, just joined in the conversation. Got a beautiful uh, bird of prey sitting up over the runway, John. Oh, yes, I see. Quite high, actually. Interestingly, quite high. Try and get perspective of how close that is. Viru Van Gadam, how are you doing? Welcome to the show, everybody. You're watching Big Jet TV live from London Heathrow, 09 left arrivals. 
we did think for one moment uh, it, it's looked sort of like sketches whether it would or not the wind direction would change but it is due to change around about three o'clock so we might end up having departures but we'll see how we go yeah Clip that. Let's just enjoy this uh, 747 pushback. John v Rivera asking if they're chemtrails. Well, you know, we uh, th there's all that sort of like. No, uh, no. <laughs> they're not. <laughs> it's a uh, vapor. Trails, isn't it, John? Yes, yes, yes. Ginny Presswood saying United 777 from Rome, Chicago, I think. Uh, is that due in, Jilly? Mark Regwell saying United 971. Uh, oh, 747 push. Oh, you're doing yeah, that now? Yeah. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Just going to let that come nicely through the shot there, guys. Thanks, Megs, for letting everybody know. Todd loving it. John Rivera, what's the white smoke? Vapor trails, my friend. Adrian Kelleher, live now. Zen Phillips saying 380. Uh, what is that? A 380 joining, or uh, where are we at with that? Just enjoy that shot. Mushtak, guys. thank you. David Alexander Guadagno has just joined. Hello, my friend. 1,100 up to Paris, Montreal, 787. Oh. Interesting that she's pushing back this direction. Very interesting. So Gareth uh, telling us the registration on that, Gareth Shepherd saying uh, Charlie India, v Victor India. Wow. And yeah guys, if you are watching on YouTube. Oh no, hold on, that was the one that went yep. around. Oh, okay. Uh, there she is just joining at the back there, JB. Oh, okay. Well, she's very close to that other two aircraft again. Rob Sky, thank you, first time viewer. Yeah, you're a long way, oh mate. Well, we're putting up with it. I think yeah, we, we get away with it. Uh, Norman um, Serfos watching in the Caribbean. Welcome, Norman, all the way from the Caribbean. Wow. Corn, um, corn, telling us or, or uh, wishing us a happy day, and uh, thank you very much indeed for that, corn. Luke Chambers, good show as always, boys. Thanks, Luke. We appreciate it. Um, obviously, not the not the money shot in terms of those trees, but. You know, New one day, one day when we're millionaires, with a chainsaw. In there. Well, we won't. Will we? we won't be able to do that. No. Maybe we can arrange something at a later date. I don't know. Isaac Tuna saying Qantas A9. Okay, so that's Qantas 380. Qantas 9. Wow, that's great. Thanks for the info on that, Isaac. Roof. We're actually on the uh, terrace at the Thistle, the Thistle Hotel Spectators Terrace. That, uh, that 747 pilot seemed very depressed. Sebastian in Colombia, how are you doing? Thanks, Ashley. David Guadagno, how are you doing? Thank you very much indeed. Paul Dobson saying Facebook viewers went up to 1600, JB. Wow. At some point, yeah, that was pretty cool. Jihan Sabavala, how are you doing? Carl Allison saying, very interestingly enough, worse than train spotting, but actually fascinating. Interesting. How about that? Wow. Wow. Very, very uh, Meg saying, is that my baby right there, A340? Two 747 in a row again, Jerry. Yes, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Okie dokie. Here we go then. Two 747s Quasi in a row. Tom versus Dreamliner, Queen of the Skies. Queen of the UK Skies. Yes. Saying there, thank you. Richard Wang working in uh, T4 later. Jane Harkers, how are you doing? Here we go, 747. Nice. Yeah. Did you grab it? Oh yeah. <laughs> We've got Wisconsin in the house. Uh, 
um, Farzad asking if uh, everybody's belonging to aviation in the house. Well, yeah, we maybe not so much aviation, but um, everybody loves uh, to see what we what we put out there because it's it is fascinating, isn't it? I mean, yes. You're kind of looking at a documentary in a funny sort of way, aren't you, Johnny? Yeah. Like a live documentary. Of <laughs> At one of the big, biggest airfields in the world. Stephen Hadfield saying um, hello. Thanks, mate. Daniel Rice, 380, just flew over his house. Paul Benino streaming live on his 60-inch TV. Wow. Harvard, good afternoon from Spain. How are you doing? John Riviera uh, asking what's the reason for... Oh, 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 oh! Got it. Now, that's a long way out. That's two go-arounds with 747. That is just crazy. That is crazy. Unheard of. And why so far out, JB? No idea. Wow. Well, let's listen to radio. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. Did she call it? I think she accidentally. She apologised. Yeah. That's nuts. Ba, temperature down again. Ba, you're not going to be very happy. So what happened, Jack? It's a long way out. So what happened? I don't know if she called something about go around and she said then she apologised. Yeah. And said, I'm sorry, I think I called that last time. My apologies. Maybe she got confused with the last one. Yeah. Uh, Thiru saying, good evening from India. How are you doing? Uh, Diana. Greenway okay, Neverson, what a, what a name. Diana Andy Greenway <laughs> Neverson saying hello from Brighton. Wow, Brighton. Love Brighton. Yeah, she doesn't like uh, aborted landings. Well, that was a long way out though, Luckily I had it on airport, yes, yes. airport static cam so we yeah. could really see it as well. Yeah. Imagine if you're filming something else. Of fuel. Well, you must be running. <laughs> Obviously, there's QF uh, going out, mate. Oh, you know what? We'll, we'll, we'll follow that, Qantas 9. There's your Qantas guys, Leo Lopez saying go around for the 747, absolutely my friend. 1.3 thousand people in the house, saw that watching go live from all over the world, Big Jet TV, saw that go around. Fantastic. And it was the same aircraft as well, JB. Was it really? I think it was, yeah. Because she said, uh, sorry about that, and he was like, no problem. Yeah, he went, no problem. Oh, well, at least the guy has to get to the land three times now, right? Tish Rosales in Chicago land, Illinois. Kyle Kidd asking if that was the same 747. Well, look on radar, you'll be able to see Yeah, look on radar, guys. Just, uh, okay, Gareth Sunset Shepherd saying, um, no. I don't think it was. I think it was. Gulf Echo, that was. Yeah, it wasn't the same. The last one was Victor India, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, the one landed. Okay, so that was two separate 747s on GAs. Yeah. Wow. Wow. How crazy is that, man? BA, you're not happy today. Thanks to Gareth Shepherd for pointing that out. And Wagner Souza on um, on um, just seeing a, uh, a notification pop up on my phone, Johnny. There's that going on there, YouTube. Cherry. Oh, there she is. Yeah. Uh, videos are amazing from Wagner Souza. Thank you very much indeed. Wow. Just to let everyone know, if you if you don't want to get your comments read out by watching us on Facebook, as that's what we're reading out. If you if you're content with staying on YouTube, that's absolutely fine. Make sure you watch in 1080p. Yeah. Because it's incredible, isn't it, Jerry? But I tell you what, though, it has to be said. Yeah. The 720p is just oh, it's just it's as good. Fantastic. I mean, uh, give us a little bit of comparison there, guys. It's on, fantastic. Uh, if you're watching Facebook on your big TV, yeah. uh, how's the quality coming out? Give us a bit of feedback. 747, nice idle taxi coming, coming up on your left, Johnny. Well, you know what? Listen we'll, to her. Oh, we'll get this 747. Yeah. Give me uh, 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 triple seven. Sorry. Okay. You could get you give it a swing call whenever you think it's ready. I don't know which T he's going into. This mate. is the Q8, Jay. Okay, here we uh, go. Well, this we'll is, grab this, we'll grab this. This is the plane that's only the second visit to Heathrow in two weeks old. <laughs> Alexander Surgeon saying something very interesting about that uh, 747 go around. Wow, some drama here. I think some, Lisa uh, Bond was on landing in the tower. Okay, this is new livery, is it? Yeah, no, no, no. Same, oh. well, new livery this year, but. Uh, brand new aircraft. Brand new aircraft. Wow. She is new, look at that. Wow. She's shiny, man. Try and get a close-up of the uh, reg there. 
Oh, nice. Now, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. Did you see that, man? Yeah. Did you see that? Did you see that? Yeah, got the touchdown. Wow, did you get the second touchdown? Got the second the, touchdown, the but not the... Uh, Starboard side went down first. Port side came down second. 747's wow. going in over there, so we missed it, but that's fine, man. That's fine. That's cool. Hello, Rogue Land, 09 right. 320. Well, Rob Perrow was saying that he used to come here most when he was a kid to watch Concorde. Air France 320, that cherry. Yeah, Lorraine, exactly. Uh, poor lass. Is it Air France, is it? Yeah. Wow. Normally that's a 7 8 service. Ibad in Pakistan, how are you doing? Edgar. Rebusit, how are you doing? Thiru, loving it. 1,300 still in the house, guys. Two Boeing 747s go around. Hussein saying that. Simon Shute in South Africa, how's it? Julie Fairclough asking what happened. Missed all the action, Julie. You'll have to. Uh... God, that's a long way down the runway, mate. Yeah, he's high. Wow. He's very high. Um, thanks, Cy. Appreciate it. Cy Bardsby saying we're getting some amazing footage. Leo Lopez in San Antonio, Texas. Greggy in Philippines, thank you. Farouk in Kuwait. Well, was that Kuwait we just shot? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Hey. Yeah, MZ Martin saying uh, Golf Echo did the go around. Interesting. So two 747 go around. Paul Ashley asking how many 747s? I think they've still got about 20 odd, haven't they, Johnny? Yeah. yeah. Still have got about 20 odd, but they're retiring them literally on a monthly basis. Indeed, they are. I believe. Bet you can't get that, JB. There you go. Have a go. Oh, wait for the also focus. And yeah, Mark is saying that. That's funny. Now, Jilly's saying it was the same 747 that did the GA. Interesting. Interesting. Can we get a confirmation on that, guys? Sandeep in Mumbai, India. How are you doing? Sasha saying how cool the pilot is. Anthony Marshall loving the corner 747, uh, 380. Beautiful landing there. Zaved in Kenya, how are you doing? Wow, a lot of people all over to Globe tuning wow. in right now to Big Jet TV live from London Heathrow at the Thistle Hotel. Yes, indeed. The Thistle and Weed. The Thistle is tall. Uh, now, what's that noise, Jerry? Okay, who's saying now, confirming it was not all. Oh, He's only powering up to move off. Yes. He's only a little 319. Sounded like a 747 yeah. to go. The second one was from Mexico. The first one was from Kuwait, from Hassan, saying that. I think that's official. Interesting. Thanks, Danilo. Appreciate that. Ahmed watching in Khartoum in Sudan. Graham confirming that the first was from Kuwait, the second was from Mexico City. So two separate 747s on the GA. Wow. Javith in India, how are you doing? Kaniko, thank you, thanking us for showing him the um, 380. She'll be going out any second now. I think she's actually turning onto the active now, JB. Okay. But we can get her going out, maybe. We'll get her. We'll get her going. She'll bank right, I'd imagine. Let's uh, let's let's uh, position and hold for this A380. See, that's interesting. Gareth saying uh, Victor India both went around. Oh yeah, uh, Golf Echo and Victor India. Oh, look, that's her tail. Yeah, so, she sorry, she's turning onto the active now. So they, so they both went around the... Uh, yeah, 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 two sense. separate ones. Gulf Echo and Victor India. So this is going to be interesting, Johnny. You'll hear it. Let's just... I'll just shut my mouth now. She goes, Jerry. Power up. Full takeoff speed. Nice. There's a QF again, guys. And 747. Euro wings landing, but that's alright, yeah. Get that Queen taxiing in the position, mate. John Rivera, thank you for watching. Jesse from uh, Quebec City watching with his mates. Wow, Quebec City. Yeah, we had the uh, 
the, the little 319, the Air Canada 319 that heads out to St. John's all the way across the Atlantic uh, we shot earlier on. Yeah, yeah, Canadian yeah, fans. Michael Elridge watching for the first time from Texas. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Enjoy the show. Please go on and like our page, guys, if you can. Corners going out there. There's a lot of arg not arguments, but a lot of sort of like um, uh, about the seven four. Yeah, about the seven four. <laughs> no, was it wasn't. It? Yes, it was. <laughs> I don't think it was. No, it was two separate aircraft. This is another Qatar by the looks of it, JB. Is it really? Another Qatar okay, we'll on uh, on standby from. Um, oh yes. For uh, stand uh, standing in for the. Um, striking British Airways guys. John Rivera watching on 55 HD TV. They all look brand new, don't they, Johnny? They do. Although I must say, where they come from, um, they don't get much rain and rust and stuff, exactly. do they? Exactly. Over here you can really see the... Oh, yeah. uh, Star Alliance. So yeah, nice. We, we, nice. We, we rarely see her. She's old as well, man. Old She's 777 Wendy van der Weg, uh, uh, hoping to see the China 787. Uh, yeah, we love that livery. Is this the China 787 coming in now, JB? Maybe, maybe. Uh, Mark Redwell, it's doubtful that we'll be able to pick up the military on the scanner if we do go to Fairford. And if we do go to Fairford, it's next Wednesday, guys. John Hunt, how are you doing? Guys, if I'm way behind here on the comments, please uh, take, uh, accept my apologies. But there's just so many of them, I'm trying to get in as many as I can. Yay, uh, yeah, yay, saying that uh, what a show, 2747 go around. Yeah. Less than 10 minutes. Oh, it's what a great. show. I mean, great. really, it's, it's very rare, but it's good to see. So, oh, it's United, my favourite uh, Dash 9 livery. Mohammed in Malaysia, how are you doing? Qantas 9 in 13 minutes. I think that's, is that the one coming in or the one going out? I've got a 747 that's coming in yeah. after this JB and I think that GA. is the GA. Oh, Ross Bailey confirming uh, Qantas um, QF09. So um, that's uh, Qantas 9, isn't it? That she's, is she's downwind on approach. But is she going in left or right? She's coming in on the, on the left, mate. So we've got a 747 and a 380. Oh, man. One behind each other. What's there. the runtime on the feed then? Come up to the hour yet? Uh, 51 minutes. 51 minutes. Well, how about I'll just do the 74 and then we'll do a swap seat. Otherwise, <laughs> I'm going to finish off these two and then you're going to be left with Tiddlers. Danilo, thank you very much indeed for that. William Tusha, how are you doing? Um, Kumar in Oman. So is this the GA aircraft, guys? Uh, Qantas Golf commented on uh, YouTube. Thank you very much indeed. Uh, Qantas Golf, uh, we're actually um, we're reading out comments on Facebook, guys. So if you want to, if you want to have your comments read out, um, or at least for us to. Um, is that yeah, it's definitely quite a story. Yeah, yeah. If you want us to acknowledge you on Facebook, guys, come over to Facebook. Um, Here comes the Queen. Sergi saying that the uh, 747 is already landed, one of those. Uh, Leo, Leo Carroll, how are you doing? Beautiful aircraft. That one was a beautiful aircraft. I don't know which one we're talking about. Um, Hector in Abu Dhabi, thank you very much indeed. Jilly confirming. Majid, thank you. Faser, how are you doing? Mark Redwell, right. I'm going to head all the way down. Oh, here we go. in Denver, Colorado, how are you doing? Andrew Grist in Wiltshire. Lloyd Thomas talking about saying lots of money, not sure about that, made lots of money. Well, I guess all air airports, that's what it's all about. Brian Long in Preston. Indeed, it is a great day for it. Very hot out here. 
Uh, Mohammed Jabir saying that he loves triple sevens. We love triple sevens, the big golfers. Gary Bass, T-E-W-A. Not quite sure what that is. Are you getting that, James? Is that a Thompson Dreamliner? Is that backing it up? Yeah, I think that's a Thompson Dreamliner. So that 747 that you just shot, JB, that was the GA, I believe. Yeah. Uh, Graham, Tom and asking if you've set the camera to HDR, John. It doesn't work as well. It doesn't work as well on HDR. Yeah. There you go, Graham. Right, Jerry, here we go. Straight in with the 380. Thanks, Nalu Thamba. There you go, mate. There you go, chap. On the side, the surface wind, 180 degrees, 6 knots. Runway 09 left, clear for here we go, Qantas 9, one of our favourites guys. It's coming in hot JB. Yeah. What an aircraft. Looks great in that livery doesn't it? Oh she does. There. All our Aussie mates, here you go. Touch down that little spot. No, she's long, she's long. Not even touched down yet, Jerry. There she goes. Wow, late on those spoilers, wow, man. Yeah. Just so much vapour dispersion there. And it looks wow. like another four-engined aircraft joining the back of the stand. 747 going out. I mean, I don't like to get radar because I like the surprise. Yes. But I can see a 747 looks to be a number two for landing after the next arriving, uh, what looks to be a tiddler as well. Jane Harker's going to be here going to Legoland soon. Yes, he was. Super, super means A380. Steve Laws, BA4156 missed and BA242 missed from Mexico. Are you visual with the women? Exactly, I don't think I want. I think I want to thank you, I'm clear visual approach from A09. Wow, that is a 382 out. Wait, visual approach? Is that standard guys, visual approach, or is it normally clear for an ILS approach? At, at places with the guide slope. Visual approach, does that mean that maybe the... So uh, Qatar 319, which is parking up in Terminal 5. It's a visual approach here, Jerry. I'd yes. get on him, mate. There's no ILS, he's hand flying the whole thing. Yeah, but he's only a little one, isn't he? Yeah. I'll get him, I'll get him. Because he's, no, um, he's on a manual approach, not yes. on ILS. That means no toga, uh, yeah. I think. I'm just going to go down to the bottom of the comments here, guys. Because they're literally off out. Interesting. Look how close that 747 is behind as well. Yes. Imagine if we had another go around, Jerry. Wow. Three go rounds in one day. Unheard of. Sure, that's a 747 two out. Well, he used the word super. It definitely is a. I mean, it could be a 380, but it looks like a 747 from here. Could be the BA380 though. He used the word super, which only is with 380. Though. Yeah, that's a 380, all right, mate. Yeah. Yeah, Richard Stokey, they're using visual approach. So all being hand flown here. Is it that Tarom 319? 318, yeah, Tarom 318. That's like a dash, oh no, it is a 380. little thing. If she's up, she's going to go down in the gap. <laughs> Listen to that beautiful. Uh, Look how fast she's turning. Yeah. Slow down a bit now on the brakes. Wow. Well, you know why? It's going around aircraft, isn't it? Yes. He's got to get to the gate, man. He's got to get to the gate. Jerry, I'd pull it now, man. I Probably mean, busting uh, for a wee, isn't he? Yeah. 
There's a 380 smoke. Oh, gotcha, oh, gotcha. Long shot, the live stream. Oh, Joe Hyam says a long shot, but a live stream from uh, St. Martin would be awesome. You know. Well, yes, we, we, we would love to do that, guys. It's in our target range at the moment. Yeah, it's on our bucket list, put it that way. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, listen to that 747. 380 Super. Beautiful day here, love it, Heathrow. Big Jet TV Live. No, she won't. God's sake. Still not down. There we go. So a couple of supers down a bit late. Mind you, saying that, you say late, JB. Look how close we are. We are right yeah, opposite exactly. the beginning. We're at the piano keys are right there, guys. Exactly. That is the piano keys. You can just about pick them out. The touchdown zone is right just like Yeah, the touchdown zone, you can see the blackness there. Yeah. Just where that 380 tail is there, that's your main touchdown point, but it actually continues on yeah. all the way down. What I've noticed here at Heathrow as well, the touchdown, yeah. the touchdown point is quite uh, close to the actual end of the runway compared to other airports. Why that is, I don't know. I'm sure somebody will be able to tell us in just a second. Dreamliner heading. People saying don't tell the boss. Got Rizwan Sabine loving the show from Dubai. Richard Stokay saying ILS will likely be operational and providing them guidance, indeed, but they'll probably just be using the happy lights and hand flying it in. Once you're visual with the runway, you're, vis you're cleared visually. In low vis, you get the ILS clearance mask. Wow, that's pretty damn good information. That's Who's that? Who's that? That's uh, Richard Stokoy. Wow. So Richard must be at least a pilot, or at some point he must Absolutely. must knows what he's talking about. Surely. I mean that makes definite sense. But uh, well, he wouldn't just say it, would he? You can't, you can't make something like that up, can you? No, yeah, but that's I mean great knowledge there, but it's uh, common knowledge that. Oh, but uh, what I'm saying is, is that well, common knowledge to pilots, but not to me. Yeah, <laughs> indeed. Um, but uh, happy lights. Never heard of anything like it. You never get. The Pappy lights just look quite nice. Oh, okay. Uh, you'll never get... Um, what about the Mammy lights? <laughs> <laughs> and they've never heard a visual approach being confirmed and then a confirmation that they actually want to continue the visual approach because there's a 747 turn off the runway. Very oh, yeah, interesting. Man, sticks are... It, it's, something's got to be it's done here. American 777-200. She's an old gal. A little bit of uh, tire perspiration. Wow, carving Kiko William, loving it from Guam. Descri Guam describing man. it as an air show. <laughs> well, it kind of is, isn't it? Yeah. A little bit of Darren Livermore action going on over there. Get it dead on the line, me old son. Brad Frago watching from Lake. Winner Pasaki. Wow. In New Hampshire, USA. Beautiful morning here. After breakfast, you need to get outside and watch contrails overhead. Yeah. Wow. Here goes that 777. Oh, oh, oh. That Star Alliance United 777-200. Startup 380 yeah, right opposite yeah, of guys, yeah. if you're wondering what that noise is. Now, that's interesting. I've never seen the United Star Alliance. Yeah. What's he doing, though? Is he going or what? Going. Any second now. Mind you, he would have gone already, Jerry. That looks like... He's got tech, mate. That looks like tech. That looks tech. That looks like he's about to come off. Yeah, mate, no, there's definitely something going on there. Yeah, something, something happened. Yeah. Situation going on there, guys. Anyone know? Just follow that uh, 777. We'll see his tail yeah. appear um, just to the left there of the... Um, so this won't be great to go bang straight onto uh, departures ATC. But it could be the old style ones. We can, can't we? Yeah, okay, I don't think anyone holding till November 5th. 
Or was he just rolling? He was just rolling. He's gone now. Maybe follow him out, Jerry, because he uh, sometimes they do that when they have a bit of a weird indicator. Because I saw something like. else going out, mate. He should be going out around. He'd get his tail just going across there, maybe. Yeah, there goes the tail. It's going to go out by the fuel tanks, I yeah, think, mate. Just afters, I think. Just after the tower. Oh no, it's going to be later, isn't it? He's just starting yeah. about halfway down the runway. Yeah, he's going to be past the tower, there I reckon. Is. Bloody hell, all the way down there, look. Yeah. High, uh, high climb rate, yeah? Very high climb rate indeed. Hard bank, definitely an American flying that plane. <laughs> wow, I've got 380 coming up back to me now as well. Got David Hancraw watching from te uh, Nashville, Tennessee. <laughs> Jason McBain loving it. Welcome, Jason. He's got a tidbit coming in. <laughs> Javier Del Angel, watching from Houston, Texas, USA, watching the feed live and flight on and on Flight Radar 24 live. Well, how? Well, that is the ultimate combo there. Flight Radar 24 and uh, Big Jet TV live. Watching from Dubai. Apply a little bit more sunscreen. There's a uh, looks like a BA seven eight seven nine coming in now. Oh, nice big one going out. Yeah. That banking, that that one banking. Yeah. That's uh, United. Yeah, me and all my. Thirsty for a golden pick. Dreamliner 787-8. Long, he's long. Let's get him in the bushes. Going from cold to hot like a door does. No, I don't think no. so, man. I don't think so. so it's just, just the head's very sticky. Yeah. Might be able to buy an actual. It might actually be able to buy another head for it. Yeah. Rather than buying the whole sticks. Luke Chambers, Israel 747 over Chigwell, quick run to Chippy, hopefully make it back in time. That's the LL, that's the LL 747. Wow, wow. Coming in. Uh, she comes in 09 left. Now, what's this? A Virgin 787 9. 9 indeed, yes. Very nice, good colour scheme. We love yeah. Virgin. Very sexy aircraft. Could be my mate Andrew skipping this one. Just got a bit Just of smoke. Just got it. Got it. Got it. Little bit of smoke. Little bit of tire smoke. Wow. Beautiful stuff, guys. Daniel Higgins, the UA did take off, my friend. It's gone. Uh, it's gone westbound now to, to the states. It did look like it was going to uh, come back to the gate, but no, she went off. She went off. Tidler stack by the looks of it, JB. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Adam White, Adam White giving us some good information here. 
So I mentioned that there'll be no Toga if you're doing a visual approach. I think that was wrong. I mean, it was a right, yeah, guess anyway. Right, Adam White. Also, Toga doesn't have anything to do with ILS pilots. Can press Toga or apply full throttle to go around yeah, at any time during nine, approach unless uh, they are below a certain five, altitude. Five, nine, nine, do you know, even though I don't know, I was going to say something about that. You're just going to say you can surely get Toga whenever you like. That's what he said. Yeah. At a given instrument, altitude. Instrument or what? Indeed, indeed. At a given altitude, pilots will commit to land just like the V1 will take off. So that's Adam White there with the info. So yeah, any 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 switch or full thrust will initiate Toga, I believe. No, you have to initiate the Toga button, don't you? The switch. I think I don't know. Is it? I think I think it's there's coming there's in. A if it applies switch. a little bit more throttle, then that's just to speed up, isn't it? I think I think if you I don't know if you go full power, that might that may apply Toga, or if okay. you press the button, that may apply Toga as well. Okay. I don't know. I'm sure we'll get the we'll definitely get the answer in about 30 seconds. A lot of friends from uh, Ireland who watch the show. This is one for you guys. Brad Barrett. I drive by Detroit Metro every day. All they have are tithers. Love the show. Thanks, Brad. Welcome to the house. If anybody's wondering what we're all about, guys, we're a couple of uh, guys who um, literally have aviation running through our blood. Um, family in aviation, we love the big jets. Um, we're just here promoting London Heathrow. What a great airfield it is. Yeah. Fantastically run, very professional. Um, yeah, we love everything about it. But we are planning on going um, further afield once we um, manage to finalise what we're doing in terms of funding. Mm. And that funding, <laughs> funny enough, guys, I know we've uh, gone round and round in circles on this one, but it looks like it's actually now going to be a uh, well, that low low climb out from that Air India, JB. Oh yeah, 7-8. That's a heavy one going over the top as well. Yeah. 747 by the looks of it. Let's have a little look. Just see that LL 7 because if that LL 747 comes in here, zero and I left. We're very lucky, what very fortunate. Treat. Yeah, what a treat for everybody. Let's have a little look on radar now. Okay, I can see a 747. <laughs> okay. I can see a 747. I can see that it's LL, and I can see that it's vectoring for a 09 left. Wow. It is seriously hot right now. Yeah, that LL's coming in, no doubt about it. No doubt about it. I see a 747 push back. Beautiful 380 sitting over there. 747 actually. Yeah, that 747 should be, in fact, you should get her coming out the back of that little bit here. Roger that. Going down like that. Turn right about Alpha. Ground 121 yeah, I'm not sure how many of you guys have heard of the, um, obviously a lot of you guys have heard of the Patreon um, platform, which is uh, predominantly for uh, people looking to raise um, funding for their projects. And uh, this is most definitely because what was it Johnny we we just thought and thought about the YouTube thing but we just have so many people not being able to to join YouTube on the subscription basis um, whereas on Patreon whereas on Patreon if we set a sort of like uh, some kind of a um, monthly target monthly target yeah and also um, people can give what they what they can afford so if you can only give a quid you can only give a quid but at the end of the day you can still watch it free yeah but you know let's face it it's all about spreading the love it will be uh, in the next month still deciding on where our next move will be yeah a lot of different variables because we want everybody to join in the love Give everybody the love. You go down early, this one. Right? So that LL747 should be pulling any second now. Uh, so 
have a little looky. Yeah, so we could be powered by Patreon, guys, but actually we would be powered by you. A bit like the old Ford advert. Everything we do, it's sit or all, it's sit or all. What do you reckon, Jay? 20, uh -oh. 25 degrees? We've got a good stat without it. And he's got blue and blacks on board. He's got blue and greys, and so he's definitely, uh, he's definitely coming in here, look. Because <laughs> we've got blue and blacks and greys in here. Seems to be a popular colour, that in metallic blue, doesn't it? At the moment. Yes. Right, let's have a little look here then. Today. Right now, 25 degrees. Not bad, not bad. How many bad. people we got in the house, man? 1.1. 1.1? Yeah. Okay, so we're floating on that thousand, that's good. What's that third out? It's not him yet, is it? just completely stopped though, so... Is it? I'm going to refresh the feed. Still keeping an eye out for that now. seem to be coming. Now look like we had a little bit of a uh, glitch crash on the comments. Can see people joining, there's no comments. Wow, that's a big one over there, isn't it, JV? Yeah, yeah, she's gone. This looks like a Dash 8. Austrian 320 Look now. at the size of the blister on this, guys. The Wi-Fi blister. Look at it. That bird, that bird right in the... Look uh, at it. That bird. It's actually further this way. No air Okay, watching from Taiwan, Jason Stencil. Wendy van der Weg, China Southern, 25 minutes out. Rex Jarvis, Easy Jet and Jet 2 at Heathrow, no. Bloody focus, man, come on. Is that a resident buzzard, guys? Fiona Dimple is watching from Pakistan. Welcome from Pakistan. There's that 747. There she comes. We She's see her. She's joining up. Yeah, we got LL 747, guys. So we got her. Um... Actually, Jerry, that is the 777, I believe. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah, I think. Or well, it could be the LL. Oh no, I see the LL. Yeah? Oh yeah, oh, I see her. She's coming zero and I left. She's low, she's heavy. So we've had a great day of uh, streaming so far and it's about to get a whole lot better. Stay where you are, guys. Yeah, don't go anywhere, guys. Just about to get exciting. Just uh, Mohammed, Mohammed also adding to this uh, excitement. Coming in 10 minutes, a big fat A380 by Emirates from Dubai. Mm, Dubai. She could be vectored in on the right though, couldn't she, Johnny? Very well, but she is coming on the northerly side. Interesting, of the another Star oh, Alliance. Yeah. Interesting. Well, that that dude, could be that's United as well. That could be the Did he go what? tech and Some... then turn round and come back? Somebody said the other one was um, was not was that Delta. One. Yes. So that could be the. Uh, that was that was one. Tech that, a bit like what happened the other day with yeah. the Dreamliner. But it was suspicious how. We heard the spool up and didn't see the plane go across the thing. And but I saw late. a smaller one going off before it, and then it started to taxi that one. Yeah, I don't know, so I, don't I thought know. he can't surely be. Oh, well, here we go. I don't know. I just don't know. Who knows? Nobody knows. That's why it's just a. Uh, the secret of the black magic box. Yes. I may go get a drink. Or something, all right, man. All right. Fancy a drink? I'm, I'm good at the moment, mate. Yeah. Okay, so Why don't then, we wait for the LL? Because then we're then we're just on two hours, aren't we? And yeah, no, that's true. That's and true. then we're done, aren't we? I'm sure people won't. Uh, there he goes. Look, there he goes. Nice. If I can, uh, there he is. Yeah, nice and white that one. Never seen a United Star Alliance. Unless I've seen it and I just haven't acknowledged the fact that it's got United under the Star Alliance. Yeah. 
So guys, possibly Fairford next Wednesday. We'll have to see what's going on there. We're still trying to get hold of the guys at Riyadh for passes, but I don't think it's going to happen, to be perfectly honest. Well, yeah, when someone doesn't reply to your email after two weeks, you can't yeah. take that as a no. <laughs> yeah, but they did ask us. Yeah, they replied, but then... But then went reply. dead. Yeah. I think it's because we're live, because they've already got a live stream there. But it's boring. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's not. It's, it's very, very informative and very good fun. James Andrew Codgen saying, I would love to watch this all day, every day. <laughs> Well, if you want to watch it all day, every day, um, make sure you contribute when we next open up our uh, bit of Darren Livermore going on there. Karan Singberg and Al after this next Turkish Hello, 777. Do the Turkish 777 and then an Al 747. Is that a Smokey Joe being towed? I think it is, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, she's going back to the gate. Oh, here we go. Shadow. For Wad Hussein watching from Malaysia. Wow. Leo Lopez, no, we're not model plane collectors, although I do think model planes are awesome. I've made a few model planes in my time, though. Oh, yes, it has course, to be said. Of course, of course. And uh, yeah, but but but. And that's very you know, true. Not, yeah. But not the ones out of the box. No. Um, no, hand built. Hand built. Like yeah. my Lancaster. But. I made a 747 later. once and then turned it into a disaster maybe you see it back up, <laughs> lit it on fire and everything. That doesn't surprise me about you, JB. <laughs> what was that, last week? <laughs> disaster movie. <laughs> disaster movie. Here's LL, yeah? Yeah, here comes the LL, 747. David Mallow watching from San Diego. Will Perro. Emirates 380, 10 minutes, 5 minutes now probably. Hello, 315, runway 09 left, clear the lap. 315, 05 knots. Stand by. Christian Turkish, uh, PM me, uh, we'll try and get that sorted. Sarah Lane, have we got your sticker on the way? Alpha, yeah. 6.5 miles uh, on our left. This is a rare girl. She's being um, retired in September, guys. So get it when you can. Going to be uh, replacing it with triple seven Dreamliner initially. Sharif watching from Q8. There's a Qatar 319 about to go out, one of the standbys on British Airways fleet. So what are we doing then JB? Are we hanging, are we hanging on for this uh, Emirates 380 or what? I think so, I mean a lot of people are asking us and telling us, 380, okay, well, we'll, uh, 380, they seem to love the Emirates 380. Yeah, yeah, it's very, very popular. Yes, it's an international yes. cruise liner. Yes, yes, yes. And we will do that for you guys, and then we're going to head out um, and continue our uh, our day of um, mediment. But yeah, so um, how many people we got, JB? 1.2 in the house. Still 1.2. That's good. That's good. Remember the days when we had the old iPhone? 12 people watching, Johnny. We got 12 people. We only had nine yesterday. Oh, look, it's an Emirates 380 going out. Oh no, BA. Sorry. I really am seeing things today, mate. It was just a glance, though. It's you know, sometimes waves. when you glance, yeah, 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 I know. I know. you just get a little glance there. Mm -hmm. 
Darren Livermore special. Mohammed Rashid El Habi is asking us, pleading with us to stay for the triple seven tam in ten minutes. I love, All about you, Mohammed. I love this bird. Yes, we'll as a lot of people tam. do. That could be the tam there. Look, coming in from. Uh, you can actually see it pulling onto the back of the stack. Marcus just PM me about that. Um, oh, low climb out, 380. Wow. Oh, beautiful, low and slow. That's the one that goes low over my house, Johnny, isn't it? Yes. If he, if he goes right, but he's but, not. He's, but when he goes right, it is, yes. Oh, look, there's the... Uh, Oh, it's just the United 787, that's all. Yeah. Well, here comes a tray. Yeah, righto. United uh, Dreamliner lining up for departure 09 right. Scandinavian 805, runway 09 left, clear for left. Wind 26.05. SAS 737-700 or 500, I can't remember. I can't tell from here. Those distinctive flat bottom engines, man. Yeah. No uh, winglets at all. I think that's a 500. Yeah, because all the uh, sevens and eights have all got winglets, haven't She's they? going down early, Jerry. Just. We got it. Just. We got it. Nice fast approach, though, stand from those 737s. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, there's the 380. Oh, here low we go. Slow and slow. Two to go, guys, and then we're going to say our goodbyes. But um, the plan is to be back Saturday if we can. Nice American triple seven going out. Is it or is it a 3:30? Oh no, no it's 3:30. Tam, yeah. Tam is before the Emirates, so uh, uh, nice cut to finish. Okay, yeah. So we've got three to go, JB. Got some interesting information here from Jamie Woods. Yes. Since watching this, you have had more airplanes than what any of New Zealand's airports get in a single day. That is incredible. That's crazy. That's the difference. Well, that's why there's an argument about going to an airfield that doesn't have a lot of movement, Johnny. Exactly. You've got to keep everybody, and they can't hit, listen to us waffling on for, you Indeed. know, all that time. They just get bored of it. Yeah. You need to have aircraft movements in the shots. You do. It's quite a nice set. Uh, Position here for that as well with T5 yes. right in front of us. Seven forty seven going now. Oh nice. We'll get Listen going. to that. We'll get her going out. Oh look at that stack. Get a nice shot of that stack. Let's yeah, try it. Daniel Rice just confirmed that it was a 700 series from Oh okay, so sevens don't have the uh Thanks a lot, Christian Turkish. Oh, oh, is that 320? It's only a 319 or 320 pushing forward. Super. Look at that shot there, mate. So that's interesting, American uh, American pilot on that Emirates, mate. Yeah. Here comes the TAM. Beautiful livery on this TAM. Yeah, I do like it. Oh, it's an APU if I've ever heard one. By Joe, it's very hot. Go on, slam it down early, mate. He's going in late. The magic red carpet. Oh, I just got, got him. him. Coming up next on the Big Jet TV live stream is the Super A380 Emirates. Emirates Super. High climb out that 747 JB. 
Jamie Woods, I'm sitting here in awe, guys. That is insane. If we were to take that many here in New Zealand, our ATC would lose their marbles. Go the All Blacks lines going down. <laughs> Bought by the Air New Zealand. Fantastic. Thanks for watching all the way over in New Zealand. It's yeah. as far as you can get, Johnny, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. That's as far as we can go. That is practically as far as we can go. <laughs> it certainly is, Stanley. What time is in New Zealand now? It must be the next day. Well, <laughs> or the evening time tonight or something like that. No, 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 it won't it? be. It'll be tomorrow morning or something, yeah. won't it? Or something, something crazy, crazy like that. Yeah. Go to Qatar 320 departing to one night. I'm going to follow this boy all the way in. Yeah, dual arrival there. It's like a 320 or 73709, right? Of this beast coming. Yeah, because he's doing that because of wake, isn't it? Here we're going to get clearance, Clarence. Meg's Thompson loving it. Richard Roll just uh, joined from Fort Lauderdale, Florida, hashtag VJTV. Good time to join. Canadian by the sounds of it. Yeah. Parallels, guys. Here we go. Make a noise. Yeah. Okay, well that's us. 5 a.m. in New Zealand apparently. 1 45 a.m. So yeah. it's tomorrow morning. So it's tomorrow it morning, tomorrow. yeah. Crazy. Okay, should we do a little close out, JB? Yeah, let's just have a little look just to make damn sure there's another cheeky 747 putting onto the back of the stack. So here we are, here's the faces, guys. Here's the faces of Big Jet TV. Yes, I'm big uh, and he's Jet. Yeah. We are TV. Well, we don't know about that. Really. Is that Jet or not Big? Big or Jet? I don't know, whatever. Jet Jerry, isn't it? Yes. Big John. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, um, so guys, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Up up it's but uh, I think we're on for a good two hours. Guys. Yes, we are. Flight radar's broken, so you know the sun. Yeah, so guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. Uh, thanks for bearing with us with these trees and the the CAS um, transporters, etc. etc. We will be back hopefully on Saturday. Keep your eyes out on the Facebook page. Please go in now if you haven't done so. When you come off here now, go in and like our page on Facebook. Please do that because uh, it's obviously quite important that we do that. Um, wherever you are in the world, thanks so much. Whatever time it is, have a good day, have a good evening, have a good sleep. Um, whatever you're doing. Enjoy the rest of your day and thanks for tuning in to Big Jet TV and we'll see you very soon. Absolutely. See you later guys. Watch that.